Taylor Shulwo of uh, Mornington Peninsula, Chloe Johnston of Unattached, D.D. Deng of Box Hill, Hannah Wilcock of Mentone, Remy McKay of Box Hill, Al- Alicia Cassidy of Box Hill again, Imogen Baker of Mornington Peninsula, Kayla Bridges of which that the Eureka, I believe, Matilda Strungle of Sandringham, and Monique Dewsnap of Unattached. So a pretty uh, pretty loaded field here. That was elite recognition of club abbreviations as well, Mitch. Congratulations. Thank you. I tried my absolute best there. <laughs> so seed times through this will be between 2.30 and 2.35. So five seconds separating these 11 girls. We've got our pacer again in the red singlet. Sitting in lane four. So they're all the way pretty smoothly at this point. Our two paces having a little bit of trouble getting to the front, so likely the pace is well and truly on at the moment. So I think that's Dee Dee Dang that is leading them out. Now one of our paces has got to the front spot. A bit of jostling one of our paces in the, uh, trying to, to get around now as well. In the midfield there, everybody trying to find a spot at the 200 mark. And the pacer has absolutely gone for it. And no one's having a bar of it at the moment, but they're about to spread themselves out here. About to come into the straight. And it looks like DD Deng's going to be the one to, to trail off the pacer there with the big group set behind her. So it really does look like this field has kind of broken up into a little bit of two. So probably about 111, 112 is what we would have liked to send them on through. So 67, that's a pretty quick first lap. So that is why we probably got the bulk of the athletes sitting off the pacer just a little bit. So like did it in and Hannah Wilcock there. Only one's about to come with the pacer as the rain starts to fall now. Yeah, the rain is starting to come down pretty hard. It still looks like the wind is not too strong. So that can be the hardest thing with the conditions when you've got a strong wind presents a big challenge but just a bit of rain won't spoil the spirits of these athletes so Dee Dee Deng still leading us out behind her Hannah Wilcock of Mentone trying to bridge the gap just a little bit Kayla Bridges so it's Bridges Bridges the gap she is doing a great job it, it's it's quickly starting to get eaten into but Dee Dee Deng to Wilcock our top two, Bridges, she's inching closer. She's moving up there, but Dee Dee has gone gun to tape outside the pacer. And she's wanted all of it. So she leads into the straight here. And I don't think she's going to get caught. She's moving away now. But you're right, Bridges is absolutely flying up here now. But I think Dee Dee going to hold on to this one. Yeah, so it might not be enough time for Bridges. Dee Dee Deng, fantastic running, 2.29. We've got her Bridges right on about 2.30. Matilda Strugner across the line of Sandringham and a strong finish. I believe that was Imogen Baker of Mornington Peninsula and Claudia Irving of Sandringham to round out that 